Hey, take a look at this right here. We're, this is a live look at Cape Canaveral. The U.S. Space Force just launched that rocket, the Atlas V rocket. It's putting into orbit the sixth and final missile warning satellite for the military space-based infrared system. And the Pentagon tells us these satellites can detect the heat plumes from a missile and rocket launches. That'll provide some advanced warning just in case of a possible attack. And Greg, this is uh, one half of a double header today because tonight SpaceX has a launch at 7.08. Really, really busy there on the East Coast. Uh, this should be a pretty interesting launch because as that rocket get, gets higher and we start separating out the stages, we may get some beautiful views of some of the vapor clouds created by that as the sun is rising off the East Coast. Sunrise this morning, I've got it at around uh, 654. So that should light up that rocket from the south and east. Uh, so if you are walking, biking or running this morning, or if you're driving from St. Pete into Tampa, you definitely want to slow down and take a look at that eastern sky. Should be a beautiful view uh, this uh, morning. This is a view from Action Air 1. You see it. You see how orange wow. the vapor cloud is. It's getting lit up by the sun from below. Absolutely beautiful. That is really going to be something uh, that uh, folks notice. If you see this, please snap a picture and send it to me. Greg.dee at WFTS.com. You can also tag me on Twitter and Instagram at Greg D. Weather. I would love to show your photos on the air as that Atlas rocket now continues to climb. It is headed towards the east over the Atlantic, so any of the subsequent stages will be dumped out over the Atlantic and they'll collect those pieces to bring them back towards Cape Canaveral. Uh, that uh, satellite on board built by Lockheed Martin, it uses infrared technology to detect missile launches all across the world. So if any other country launches a ballistic missile, that's how the military knows where and when that happens because of these advanced advanced sensors built right here in the United States. It's actually fascinating and it's so cool to watch too. I'm waiting for the phones to start ringing because you know people are going to call and they're like, what in what the is world that? is going on? Exactly. <laughs> right. So now you know. Yes, it never gets old looking up and yeah. seeing the, oh, no. the trails and the plumes from those rockets so all the cool. way over here. So yeah. cool to watch.